Hi everyone, it's Dr. Christina Romcook and I'm coming to you from Nashville, Tennessee. I wanted to talk to you guys today about some plants that are really good to be around and to have in your home. Um, many of you guys have heard me talk about COPD and the instances of death. You know, if you look at the top 10 things that cause death in the world, COPD is right up there with them because respiratory issues are a main concern. And a lot of people think when they're inside their house, they don't have to worry about it. And that's not correct. Many of you guys know that I'm a research scientist and that I work on science, not just when it comes to um the body, but I also do a lot with the environment. And some of the patents that I've written have to do with the land, sea, air, water, and up to the stratosphere. And I do look at a lot at the air because the World Health Organization says that that's one of our major issues is that our air is polluted and it's not clean. And again, just because it's inside your house does not mean it is. In fact, we know that the inside air can be the worst. So what do you do about it? Well, you need to put plants and different things in your home. That's one of the things that can help with it. There's a lot of different things you can do to help with the air in your home, like opening the doors and letting the air breathe or having different types of filtration system and air systems that can help. Um, but also plants are very, very good for the air. And I want to talk about what plants are important. Um, and I, I categorize these as health plants, wellness plants, things that really help your health, mood, and the air. Um, so one of those things is English ivy. It's very good to have English ivy inside your home. Bamboo palm is another thing that's extremely good to have inside your home that can help with the air and can help with different things um, around the house to really purify it. Spider lily is another plant that's very important to have in the home. And anytime people come to my home and they'll look around in different rooms, there's either flowers or plants because I know how important it is for the air to have those things. Another thing that a lot of people don't know about um, are the garden mums and the peace lily or two, two plants that I think people often overlook that are very good for health and wellness and the air around you and that are very good to have inside the home. I always try to have aloe vera as well because aloe vera not only helps with the air but it also is something that you can cut off and use on your skin or use to take orally. Um, that really supports the body. We know that aloe vera is one of those uh, plants, one of those seeds, plants, oils um, that really help with different things. And then don't forget the herb plants like your uh, lavender. It's very good for the air, good, very good for filtration, very good for your mood and overall wellness um, and health. That's something that I tell people to make sure that they have in their home. And then rosemary, oregano, and basil are plants that are very good to grow inside the home or outside the home and to use for health and wellness. And I think I think it's very important. You know, everyone's worried during this time of year with the coronavirus, and I don't want to minimize it, but you could put different things in your home that you can also use or eat or take that help with the air in the home and help with detoxing the air in the home, but also help you if you take them orally or rub them on your body. So um, those are all things I think are very important. So remember your bamboo palm, <laughs> your aloe vera, your spider lily plants, your peace lily plants, your garden moms, your oregano, your basil, your rosemary, um, and again, lavender. I keep saying lavender. And English ivy is very good to help with the detox. I think people forget about this, but remember the inside air has been exposed to a lot of things and there's a lot of chemicals in your house a lot of different things are that are not healthy for your lungs and i think people often forget that one of the top 10 reasons people die are copd and different issues that have to do with the lungs and breathing it's very important that you have clean air thanks everyone i hope you have a fantastic and wonderful monday and share this with anyone that you want to and remember to stay positive to focus on good things and have an amazing day thanks so much